coins move at exactly the same time. Sorry if you've already covered it. Yeah, it's called Hart's Law. I coined it. The prices of assets that trade versus each other move with each other because they're interchangeable and they're bonded by their liquidity. And so if you can exchange a Bitcoin for an Ethereum at a certain rate and Ethereum goes up in value, then Bitcoin has also gone up in value because they're interchangeable with each other. And if you're holding Ethereum and it's interchangeable with Bitcoin and Bitcoin goes up in value, then Ethereum also goes up in value because they're interchangeable with each other. And so those relationships can break when there's not enough liquidity to bond them compared to what the market force wants to do. And so you, you, the market can execute its will to shift the pairing and to shift the rate that the two things exchange at, but that takes active effort from the market. And so like, for instance, if a big bid comes in and moves the price up, it eats all the sell orders. And then if the price goes back down, like by market orders, there's just a huge gap and people have to manually refill in the sell orders that were washed away by the big wick. And that, that effort of needing to change the order book, it, it means that your default position is kind of the two things that are tied together tend to be tied together. They're tied together by their liquidity. And so their prices move together. So if you, if you if for instance, if each pair of my underwear was worth a million bucks and then, uh, some guy came along and it was like, I think Richard's underwear are worth $1.1 million now. Am I making a bad analogy here? This is a terrible analogy. I'm going to give up on this one. <laughs> <laughs> so basically it's just that the prices of things that trade versus each other mean that they both tend to go in the same direction because they're bonded by the by their liquidity. <laughs>